All right, David, just want to send you this quick video. That way we could both be on the same page. Um, let me go in here, log in this, go to your work orders, go right here. This is my test work order. So it's nothing really that's messing around. If we see the status, these are the status that they're going to see. Um, they can switch it to. It's going to be in scheduled. Obviously, um, uh, in progress, they could change it to or check complete. Um, other than that, they, you know, when they complete a job, but when they're doing the job, they uh, want to go, I guess, right here, put in their information. You know, I already, you see that this, uh, the time automatically uh, corresponds with the time that, time and date. Um, that I just punched in, um, logged into the labor. Uh, when we want to save this, we come back. Uh, that's when we get to the to the order, to the um, to the job site. We go when we finish the um, uh, when we finish the job. That's when the tech wants to come out here, go over here, put tech completed. Uh, save that go back to labor uh, if they had any pictures they already know about to put how to put in the pictures or anything and uh, go ahead and put in click you so saw I just went in here went into the same order and click the time again uh, it because it already we changed it to uh, tech complete and I came back in here and clicked on, um, click clicked on the time, and that populated that. We definitely they want to put in some notes. I'd already been playing with this, um, yeah, <laughs> uh, putting these tech notes. So then they want to save it, and pretty much there go your time in, time out. Because uh, I think they were having some issues with, well, Santana was having issues with the time and time out. And um, as far as the statuses, uh, so when they do all that, uh, refresh that guy. And we should be rocking and rolling. All right, see, that's, that's, that's eliminated from there. That's eliminated from there. So... That's how you do it.